Hello, how are you? I expect you're wondering how exactly sandstone is produced. I'm here to explain the process to you. Sandstone is 90% composed of natural raw materials, principally quartz, which together with a series of ligands and additives is transformed into an attractive slab. It is also important to highlight the fact that the entire production process is environmentally friendly. Everything begins with the reception of the raw materials. At Cosentino, we receive more than 30 truckloads a day, both of aggregates as well as resins and additives. This involves a thorough organization of the logistics at our industrial site. Before storing the raw materials, the laboratory team, using the most advanced technologies, takes charge of carrying out the first quality control check. The raw material has to fulfill our quality control standards with regard to mechanical resistance, purity and granulometry. This phase of the process is fundamental for obtaining a top quality final product. With the approval of the laboratory, the aggregate materials received by tanker truck are stored in silos by means of a hermetic system, free from impurities. The aggregates received in sacks are unloaded into hoppers, after traveling along conveyor belts, which allow us to optimize the material used. The resin, the ligand product, is stored in special stainless steel tanks. The material is now ready to be transformed into silestone. On the control panel we introduce the silestone color formula, which we are going to manufacture, and automatically the extraction of the material from the silos commences. The aggregates, resin and antibacterial protection are transported to the mixers, where all the materials are homogenized to form the mass. By means of a system of conveyor belts, the mass is transported to the press, passing through the distributor, which shapes the board, as well as undergoing a continuous weight control with the aim of obtaining the perfect distribution of the mixture. We now reach the press, which is ultimately responsible for giving the product the consistency with which we are familiar. Via sophisticated vacuum cleaning and simultaneous vibration systems, we extract all the air from inside the mass and obtain the desired compactness. We are now on the point of obtaining silestone. The only thing now remaining is to bake and polish the mass. Our unfinished board will now spend 30 minutes in the oven at 100 degrees centigrade and then will cool naturally for 24 hours. Once the cooling process has finished, the board leaves the pressing phase with a desired shape and a calibration process is necessary in order to obtain the standard thicknesses and then to acquire the shine required by the customer by means of the polishing phase. Using a system of discs and milling drills, the excess material created during the pressing stage is eliminated. Then, the Silestone logo is stamped on the underside of the slab. At that time, the slab now has its standard measurement, and without leaving the line, various polishing machines give the slab the final finish, which is so characteristic of silestone. A final quality control phase ensures the perfect condition of the product by means of a thorough inspection of the board, verifying the specifications of the customer as regards shine, tone, aspect and size. Finally, the polished board is taken to the finished product's warehouse for sale or to our production factory where the material is transformed into a made-to-measure product for the customer. In this factory, the boards pass a second quality control check and once the useful surface area has been marked out, the board is registered in a database and placed in an intelligent warehouse with a capacity for 3,200 boards. Three independent production cells exist, which cover the present demand for orders. Each of these cells has sufficient machinery to provide for all the possible orders of our clients. After passing the quality and shipping controls, we proceed to packaging the finished product. 
We work at all times in accordance with the regulations governing risk prevention at work, using health protection and monitoring systems, a cause to which we are totally committed. Here, the process of creating Silestone finishes. We hope that you have enjoyed the video. Goodbye.